Hello viewers, today I am going to take you through an operation in which I am going to inject a steroid in gentleman's ankle. Now this procedure may be necessary for therapeutic as well as for diagnostic uh, importance, uh, especially in patients who has got a lot of pain but yet uh, not reached to a stage where uh, ankle fusion is necessary. So my goal today is to show you relevant anatomy and to demonstrate to you as how to do this procedure in a safe manner. Now when you are injecting an ankle, it is extremely important that you identify the landmark. So this is the tibialis anterior tendon which I have highlighted for you here. Now this is the anterior part of the medial malleolus. This is the tip of the medial malleolus and this is the posterior part of the medial malleolus. Now this is in between the, is the soft spot roughly here. So this will be the spot through which we are going to do our injection. Now this is what you need to do this procedure, of course you need a marking pen, this is some local anesthetic that we will give on the skin uh, just to make it as less painful as possible. This is a big needle that I am going to use to negotiate uh, into the ankle joint. This is the omnipeg die to confirm our position and this is the steroid and it is a mixture of uh, 2 ml of Depomedron which is around 80 milligram and 1 ml of local anesthetic. So in total it is around 3 ml. So the first step is to inject some local anesthetic and just go slowly and just take it as deep as possible so that you infiltrate this area and you make it as pain free as possible for the patient. So just inject and then wait for few minutes. Now if you want you can use a big spinal needle but I think uh, ankle joint is not far off so green needle is usually sufficient. So I am just going to go in the same area and then try to go into the joint looking at the CM. So I am just going to check the position under the CM and then readjust it if necessary. Now don't be shy in using the CM because you want to inject in the right spot. So uh, we have used our CM and you can see that this has gone absolutely perpendicularly if you can show it from a different angle uh, uh, Prashant. So this is almost gone vertically. So now if you look at the C arm images, our uh, needle is uh, into the ankle joint just over the anteromedial aspect, may we touch into the medial gutter. So I am going to uh, put some omnipeg uh, and when you are in the ankle joint, you will definitely feel a giveaway that you are into the joint. So let me put some omnipeg and then uh, I will show you how it looks. So now if you look, um, our ankle joint is uh, nicely seen. You can see the dye going from here flowing onto there. So that confirms our position. Now our next step will be just to aspirate this dye because ankle joint is quite uh, small. So try to aspirate as much dye as possible and then inject our steroid. So just gradually inject the steroid. Now it will be slightly tight. It won't be like injecting into a subacrural space because this this is quite tight. You see I am injecting and you can see it is coming back. So you need to apply some force and then this will go away and when we will re-x-ray you will find that the flush, you will see that the dye has been flushed out. So now you can see that uh, the dye has been flushed out and if you notice it uh, uh, with slightly more detail you can see the angle joint is also slightly opened up and that is because it is a closed space and you have injected 3 ml. So the joint is distracted and you do the same thing uh, when you are making a portal for your arthroscopy. So this is how you inject an ankle joint. So we was, this was a demonstration of how to do a steroid injection of an ankle joint and it is a rewarding procedure and it is useful both for diagnosing as well as alleviating pain in patients who have got degenerative changes in his ankle joint. Uh, I hope uh, after watching this video, you should feel uh, confident in doing this procedure. If you are visiting my channel for the first time, uh, please do subscribe and please give us a thumbs up as you will find many useful videos that will be of extreme importance for your clinical care. Uh, thank you. Please do subscribe and do share our channel.